Welcome back to the channel guys. Today I want to talk about TrustSwap. Okay, this is by popular demand. I keep getting comments about this token so I thought I would check it out. Uh, it is quite new. Uh, so we'll have a quick look at that. All right, but before we do, let's just have a look um, and an update on Kusama. Okay, so Kusama, in the previous video, we were looking at this level. Okay, but breaking that level, it came up here and it got rejected off that level only temporarily okay i actually got cold feet and got out of kusama then i said i was waiting for it to retake this level okay so when it did retake that level i did put another position in on kusama and took a very small profit as you can see that it has gone to the upside all right so it's up 50 percent and yeah kusama has got that break that we we're looking for obviously we talked about the fact it was in a clear uptrend all right so i did expect that to break out to the upside okay but um yeah i managed to uh get shaken out over here all right uh, just because i was being cautious all right i was trading with a small amount of capital that i was looking to protect um because i've got everything else tied up elsewhere all right so yeah basically kusama has done what we expected to do and it could potentially go much higher but have to wait and see how that plays out all right guys we'll want to see it get back under that level at this uh, point in time this now becomes our support moving on safe haven also is one that's still been kind of moving up all right still can't manage to uh make a lower low <laughs> all right but um yeah based on the fact that it is being listed on qcoin today as you can see we have had a little bit of a correction started all right and uh yeah if this puts in a lower high we expect that to go down further based on the fact that it has had this run up already before getting on qcoin i do expect that perhaps once it gets on qcoin or just before we might get a bit of a sell-off all right so i've got some money waiting on the sidelines in qcoin waiting to potentially pick up some cheap safe haven potentially for a long-term hold all right guys so yeah that's what i expect um i don't expect it for it to continue to the upside at the moment um you know it can go either way you know it can get on a, on a, on a second tier exchange like qcoin and it can just pump even more before it gets a dump or you can just get a dump and then people will be rushing in to buy it and then you'll get a little pump after that so watch this space safe haven is doing extremely well getting onto qcoin as well um obviously after this pump we'll have to wait and see whether i'm right or wrong but yeah i've got no position on safe haven at the moment I'm waiting to pick up some cheap bags on KuCoin, potentially. Okay, now trust swap. All right, currently sitting at a dollar, ran to 127. All right, market cap of 70 million already. Okay, 100 million total supply, circulating supply, 68 million or 68.7 million. Okay, now it's quite a new project. All right, um, thanks to you guys while I'm looking at this one because I wasn't looking at it before. So, um, yeah, this is just for you guys. I've not got any positions in on Trust Swap, all right? Um, but, yeah, you can buy it on quite a few exchanges already. As you can see, uh, quite a lot of exchanges have listed Trust Swap. And uh, considering it's quite new, it was built only in June, launched only in July. It looks like, you know, they are gaining some, uh, some recognition in this market. I mean, to be on that many exchanges already, it's quite a uh, quite an achievement to be honest all right so let's look at what trust swap actually is okay so trust swap have basically created a smart contract for time-based payments which eliminates a middleman all right i'll just read you a little bit about the background here okay so to give an example of a venture capital firm that wanted to invest fifty thousand into project tokens at a discount our company wanted to make sure that once the tokens were sent, they wouldn't sell them all at once and crash the token price. And we all know about that, right? So the only way to ensure this was to hire a lawyer to act as a middleman who would send fractional amounts of the tokens to the VC firm over time for a 5 to 10% fee. Absolute insanity. I figured there had to be something already created that implemented this service in a smart contract for a fraction of the cost. There wasn't. 
In fact, there was nothing that allowed for time-based payments at all. No trustless escrow for institutions, no trustless team token lockups, no automated employee payments, nothing. That realization happened on June 19, 2020. Here we are today. So that's how TrustFop was created, all right? And um, yeah, like I said, it's quite early, you know, June, June the 19th, 2020, that's like only a few months ago, all right? Yeah, I can see why there would be some hype around this service and why people would get behind it to back it because obviously we're all a little bit tired of uh, investors dumping their <laughs> their tokens on us, all right? Uh, looking at TrustSwap, it's basically gone up a lot already. In just a few months, this has actually gone wild. It's up about 3,000, almost 4,000%, all right? So definitely, you can see all the hype here. This is hype, all right? So it's definitely people getting behind this and that is just a crazy pump for just a short space of time. This one hasn't been on my radar, like I said. Um, obviously on coin market cap, you know, it is on quite a few exchanges, but I would like to see it on, uh, you know, one that I kind of use uh, for my trading regularly. I don't use some of those exchanges, apart from Uniswap, that's the only one that I really use that is actually on. Um, but yeah, Uniswap is good for buying and holding for trading. Uh, not so great in my opinion, okay? But where could this go from here, okay? Will it come crashing down further, all right? Or can we get that pattern that we normally see with these new projects comes up, a little bit of a correction, and then still carries on to the moon? We'll have to wait and see how that plays out. All right, guys, but definitely a little bit of hype around this. Like I said, I'll get more comments on TrustSwap than, uh, lately than what I do on any other token. So, um yeah don't get this one confused with trust wallet token um because they both got a similar kind of name no this is trust swap and there's another one called trust wallet token which we haven't talked about and we may actually talk about that on another video all right guys but uh yeah that's trust swap guys let me know what you think about trust swap in the comments are you thinking about getting into it are you in it already okay it does have great potential personally i believe but it is only early all right I don't think there is a competitor. Like I said, they've found a gap in the market and uh, they're exploiting that, all right? So yeah, TrustSwap, uh, that's it for TrustSwap. You know, I can't say much else about it at the moment because I don't really know too much. Just had a quick look at the project and I thought I'd cover it quickly considering uh, you guys are talking about it so much. So yeah, if you haven't subscribed to the channel already, subscribe, leave a like and a comment down below and I'll see you again in the next video.